Guys, uh, it's Physics here. So today I'm going to be showing you how to get more FPS in games and everything and just make your computer run faster overall, I guess. So yeah, um, but these are just the st like some tips that I would give you guys uh, if you're really looking to make your computer faster and you don't have that great of a computer. I actually have a laptop and I it's not it, it doesn't have that great of specs. So um, but I still get about uh, 50 to 60 FPS at least in games by doing this. So yeah, um, but yeah. So this is just how I get more FPS in games and yeah. So let's get into it. So the first thing that I like to do is we'll see in the recycle bin that it's probably full. So you can just right click on this and hit empty recycle bin and hit yes well I mean I just had one video in there just because I tried recording this and it didn't really go so well my throat was so dry and I kept coughing so yeah um but so the next thing that you can do is right click on your desktop and hit screen resolution so uh I have two monitors um and I'm just recording on my first monitor actually so yeah uh but you can change your, resolu your resolution and um sorry cannot talk <laughs> but um a lot of people use 1920 by 1080, but if your computer isn't fast enough, I just turn it down to 1280 by 720 because probably it's pretty. This is kind of hard on your computer sometimes, but um, and this just makes it a lot faster overall. So yeah, even for games, even just for web browsing. But uh, if you like watching videos in 1080p, you can always change your back. But if you do, you prob if you're watching this video, you're probably not even able to like watch videos in 1080p just because you're too laggy so yeah um but anyways that's it for that so you can just hit apply so you'll just want to drag this down to 1280 by 720 hit apply and hit ok so the next thing that you're wanna, gonna want to do is uh, actually go well this is uh, just a, let me say this first this is a tutorial for windows this part anyways um so yeah uh, <laughs> but yeah so the next thing that you can do um, is come here and then uh, this I have Windows 8 but uh, I have a thing that makes it look like Windows 7 but what you can do is type in control uh, control panel so yeah and then just right or just click on it not right click uh, and then just hit system and security system and then uh, hit advanced system settings so yeah uh, so this this is what uh, this will do um if you go to settings we'll just click on settings right there under uh, performance so what you're gonna want to do is hit adjust for best performance so um, make sure that you have all of these unchecked well that's what I would do if I were you if your computer is really slow uh, which mine can be sometimes I guess so yeah um but as you can see uh, right there if you go back <laughs> it it did look like I um, it didn't really have that animation that you're probably used to seeing but um if you are on Windows 7 uh, make sure that you have this last block checked uh, last part checked because um it will make it look like Windows 95 and I'm pretty sure you guys don't want that because it looks very old and very ugly and disgusting I guess so yeah um um so here the next thing that you can do uh we'll just exit out of that um is open up CCleaner and then if you have C if you have CCleaner um this will just clear up uh you can just hit run cleaner okay and this will just be clearing up all the files I guess that you really don't need and they're just taking up space and it's gonna like you so yeah um there you go that happened with that so the next the <laughs> I cannot talk <laughs> so the next thing that you can do so let's say you're a gamer right um want to play some overwatch want to play some CSGO whatever so you can just click on this so I'm let, let's say I want to play some overwatch right now so um and yes I am kind of big into overwatch I'm a Hanzo main I guess uh, <laughs> I don't know, Hans is really fun to play, uh, but yeah, so basically, uh, I just have it in windowed right now, but like, let's say that, just so you guys can see this, but um, let's say that you want to get um, more FPS on this game, so what you can do is, uh, oh, they got season 2 competitive, nice, okay, but um, <laughs> what you can do is you can, uh, well, you don't have this right here, but you can hold down control, hold down alt, and then uh, hit delete and then you'll see this thing and just hit task manager okay so um, it'll pull up task manager and what I would do is actually just right click on this and hit pin to taskbar so yeah but I already have it uh, pinned but you can just right click on it pin to taskbar um, so yeah but 
So you'll see that I have all these processes and just make sure that you have unnecessary windows closed first of all. If you really want to listen to like music or something, I just load up YouTube on your phone or something or on whatever uh, if you do have another thing. But if not, that's cool. Um, so yeah. Um, and then uh, just make sure you have all these windows closed I guess. They don't need to be. Um, if you are you like, if you do want to use Skype or Teamspeak or whatever or Discord on your computer, that's fine. I'm not telling you that you can't. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, so you can just uh, like so you'll see CS:GO or Overwatch or whatever right here, and then you can just right click on this and hit uh, go to details. So yeah, um, and then you'll see Overwatch.exe, and then you want to hit set priority and then hit high so sometimes you'll see like overwatch.exe and then like an overwatch.exe again um and then uh basically what this will do first of all is it'll put all this processing power towards the game uh and then you can just talking with my hands oh my gosh <laughs> but uh so like um, it'll put all the processing power towards the game and it won't focus on all these other programs in the background So as you can see the video probably looks a lot more laggy now because I did that and I opened up Overwatch to begin with But um, yeah, so you can right click this and then just hit set normal So yeah, you can do this with really any program But one thing that I would tell you to be aware with is make sure that your CPU is a uh, like below 90% I would say uh, you really don't want a lot of CPU problems trust me so yeah um and then I'm just gonna exit out of overwatch and stuff but yeah like I was saying earlier um if you do see like two overwatches or something make sure that you have that both set on high priority uh, and same way if you like play minecraft and it, it runs on Java so make sure you have both of those set on high priority so yeah and then that's about it, I think. Um, well, actually, there is another thing that you can do. Uh, there is a thing called Park Control. I'm not going to show you guys right now, uh, just because for the purpose of this video length, I guess. Um, but it it makes your <laughs> it it uh, just I'm having a little bit of trouble talking, but it makes your computer run of all of its cores, I guess. And I actually use it. Um, it's really nice. Just look at Park Control, and then like on YouTube or something, and then but it makes your computer run really nice, I guess, and makes it run a lot faster. So yeah, um, and then th another thing that you can do is just restart your computer every day. Um, I know that helps me, but on um, you can just you should probably just let it sit for a few minutes before you use it. So yeah, but thank you guys all for watching. Um, I hope that this kind of helped you, and yeah, I will see you guys all later. Goodbye.